All right, Steve. The game is tied. The count is three and two. Regina's on third base, waiting to be brought home. What you gonna do? Okay, all right. Okay. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a couple practice swings, then I'm stepping right up to the plate. As soon as I get a drink. <laughs> What's up, Bartender? Hey, uh, look. Why don't you just give me whatever it is that Snoop Doggy Dog had right before he made the announcement that he's leaving Death Row Records? Steve? Oh, hey, hey, Regina. I, I thought you weren't coming. Well, I, I wasn't gonna come at first, but then, uh, that's something I want to tell you. What is it? You know, it's probably something I should have said a long time hey, ago. Hey, there you are, Buttercup. I want you next to me when I make the announcement. Hello, Stever. Glad you could make it. <laughs> uh, I'd like to thank you all for coming out and sharing this special evening with me and my family. Now, please give a hand to my parents, Gladys and Reginald, on their 40th anniversary of matrimony and love. <laughs> Um, Dad, Mom, I have a surprise for you both. I have um, something here for a very special lady in my life. I've been wanting to do this for a long time, and tonight, well, tonight seemed like the perfect opportunity. Stop! I can't do it, Morton. I can't marry you. <laughs> what? I can't marry you because... because I have feelings for someone else. <laughs> there seems to be a little misunderstanding here. <laughs> no, ain't no misunderstanding. You heard her. She can't marry you because she got feeling for somebody else. <laughs> Regina, if it's about this, I just had new stones placed in my mom's engagement ring. Oh, thank you, baby. <laughs> Look at this. Those are some lovely gems. <laughs> Well, Warrington, if your announcement wasn't a proposal, then what was it? Well, I was going to tell everyone about my new television show, The Steel Report, Saturdays at 8.30, <laughs> after cops. Oh, well, never mind, uh, as you were. <laughs> What a, what a, this show is a nice party, ain't it? <laughs> you okay? Oh, sure. I just devastated a man I cared about and embarrassed him on one of the biggest nights of his life. I couldn't believe his mama took her shoes off and called you out to the parking lot. <laughs> Can you blame her? I ruined everyone's whole evening. Terrible. No. Look, Regina, you know, sometimes when I'm depressed, I like to just take a long drive. Well, then I'm counting on you to take me for a very long, long ride. You bet. Uh, Regina, look at here. You, uh, you got your gas card? Which, uh, uh, you know, I mean, because Big Daddy spent all his money buying this new suit and having some taps put on his gaiters. Mm. <laughs> oh, God. What have I done? <laughs>